Hey guys, Fran Showman here with Get Your Fix Physical Therapy and this is your Friday Fix. So as I discussed last week, a lot of our IT band issues are from that leg falling inward. Now, the reason that it falls inward can be a number of things. Today, I wanted to address it from where we hit the ground, that being our foot. So let me stand up and demonstrate it. You'll just see my leg down, but essentially, when we take a step, we ultimately, we want some good control so that knee is staying forward. But if we don't have good control through that foot, sometimes it can collapse inward, causing that foot and ankle to roll in. So what we're gonna do is start gaining some control in that foot, not by giving ourselves orthotics, not by getting shoes to do it for us, but by teaching our foot how to work like a foot is meant to work. So what does this look like? There's a couple different ones, three specifically, actually, that I like to do for this. First one is working that arch. So having that foot on the ground and working on pulling that arch up and then letting it relax. So you can see that lifts just a little bit and then we're setting it back down. Now the key to this one is this muscle on the front or this tendon on the front, it's gonna wanna do the work for you. That's not the one that we want working. We want one working that comes down the back of the leg and underneath that foot. So when you're doing this, if you're seeing this pop out, let's try to practice and figure out how to do it without that coming out. So that's the first one. Now we're gonna go to the toes. So with the toes, first one is gonna be working to lift just that big toe up. And then holding it for about five seconds and setting it back down. Now, if you can't do that by yourself yet, totally fine. We're just going to assist it. So you're going to position it there and then see if you can hold it there. If not, cool, just hold it there yourself with your hands and then relax. Over time, your brain and your nerves will remember what to do and figure it out and you'll be able to do that on your own. Work up to about 20 of those um, in a non-weight bearing position. So in a seated position on a chair or on the floor like I am. And then you're gonna work on, you're gonna bring all your toes up and try to get just that big toe down to the floor. And same thing, if you struggle with that, you can assist it for as long as needed to until you get it totally figured out. But the more you work on that foot strength, the better off you'll be. Um, like I said, with during that one of those toe ones is work on all these seated first, either seated on the floor like I am or in a chair. Then once you get really good at that, once you can do 20, no problem in seated position, then we can move it to standing position and work on it there. But until you can get control without full body weight through there, we don't wanna go to a standing position yet. So start working on those. Next week, I'll give you another great one for something else to address IT band issues. If you have any questions in the meantime, definitely email me, brianne at getyourfixpt.com. And until next time, let's go out and get your fix.